What's up guys, welcome back to Sushi Boy. Today I'll be showing you, well not showing you, well giving you a quick rundown on my new bike. The Merida 12600 I think. Uh, 2019 model. Um, so anyway, let's just get into it. Starting with the front, we got the wheel, 27.5 inch by 2.3. So they're a bit smaller, but a bit they're quite thick. Uh, it's brand new as well, brand new Maxxis tire. Can, there's even got the little whatever you call them on them. Anyway, moving on, we got hydraulic disc in the front. We got Rockshock D D Bond Air. Um, so it's got a hundred thirty millimeter travel. You change the air here, here. You got the compression here, and then you got the rebound under here. No, or was it under here? So, anyway, moving on. Uh, we got inner routed cables, aluminium frame. Uh, these handlebars they didn't come with the bike. The person I bought it off added them on as an extra, like the upgrade. So they're a bit wider than the ones that came with, but not much as of it. Not much of a difference. We got race face grips. I really like these grips. They're really grippy. Every time I ride without um, you say gloves, I get blisters. So I need to always wear gloves when I wear them. But I like grippy. So we've got the dropper post button here. We got the shifters like that and thumb again. Brakes, brakes. Uh, moving on. Dropper post. Uh, if you don't have a dropper post, I really recommend getting one. They're the best invention in the world. Going uphill, then going downhill. I really recommend it. Anyway, moving on. We got the Voxshock Deluxe 130mm travel. And this is a little bit of a different design normally than to other bikes. So this thing here, that pushes down right, when you land. But on this bike, I think it's got it on the, um, what do you call it, Trek EX8, I think it is. Um, this thing here, it also pushes up. So in a, instead of just moving down, this thing pushes up. So it's like it compresses together like that. All that really means is, is when you're bottomed out, which it looks like of nearly, um, it doesn't feel like you've bottomed out. That's all it really does. So, not much of a difference. That's the only difference, really. Anyway, moving on, we got rebound adjustment and lock in, lock out. Moving onwards, just the cheap plastic pedals. I'm getting some new ones soon, hopefully. It, she, this is just what came with the bike. So, hopefully, getting some new ones. We got hydraulic disc brake again. We got we got single casting in the front, twelve in the back. It's got Scram NX. If you don't know what they are, Scram is the brand, and then NX is just the um, model. There is a couple of higher ones like the GX and stuff, but all that, all the GX and um, higher models, they kind of just make it lighter. So the NX if, is a a good cheaper option if you're not looking for lot like lightness and it's not even that much of a difference anyway back wheel we have quick release unlike the front wheel it's not quick release um, and that's oh yeah and the wheel rear wheel like the front 27.5 by 2.3 so that's basically it 11 months old with some pretty good nick and yeah, hopefully we'll be using it sometime soon. So anyway, thanks a lot. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a thumbs up and like and subscribe. See ya.